Uh, my name is Munji Dawadi. I'm the executive director of the Libyan American Alliance. Uh, I think the ISIS problem has been an issue for, for quite some time now in the Middle East, and it seems like uh, every time we celebrate and we think that we got rid of it in one area, it pops up in another area. And I think um, what we heard today in the committee uh, speaking specifically about the Libya issue uh, and when, when talking about the ISIS problem, I think uh, we need to be extremely serious. Uh, when fighting ISIS, it's not a matter of, um, of, uh, of talk and, and uh, PR campaign like what Haftar is trying to do. He's trying to convince everybody that he is fighting ISIS, but I think what he's doing is creating the, the, uh, the conditions for ISIS to actually thrive and, and return to some of the areas in Libya where some of the militias with the help of, of others to get rid of ISIS. So um, also what bothered me in some of the interviews that he gave lately that he said that he was caught some ISIS uh, members who were coming from Tunisia and we know Tunisia has, has some of that issue as well. And when the reporter asked him what, what did you do with these members of ISIS that you caught, he said we took them to the border of Tunisia and we released them. Mm -hmm. And that was a shocking, you know, uh, revelation to say. I mean, this is a guy that claims he's fighting, you know, terrorism and fighting uh, ISIS, but yet he, he just puts them on a, on a neighbor country that peaceful, that always maintained great relationship with Libya, even under these conditions, and he releases these elements uh, at the border. That's very, uh, very concerning. I absolutely agree with that. I think fighting ISIS is not, is not a military fight only. I think the military fight is important, and we have to do it. Um, but, at, you know, it's a culture war. It's an ideas war. And I think we have to create an environment in any country, in any region, where good ideas have the chance to defeat bad ideas. We think that ISIS and, and Al-Qaeda come from bad ideas, from bad interpretation of Islam, of the great religion that we have. Uh, and I think we have to allow people who have the good ideas to be able to convince, especially the youth, talk to them in a language that they understand, reach out to them, use every tool that is possible, empower them, and I think we can win. We, we really have a chance to win this fight. We just have to create the conditions for the win.